Hey guys, today I want to show you how I solved the problem with an external hard drive on my uh, Mac computer. So what happened was that I accidentally pulled the USB cable out of my computer while the hard drive was still in use or still mounted at least. So in, the next time I plugged it back in then the uh, hard drive was recognized but it just wouldn't be uh, mounted anymore and if I go here to the disk utility I could click on the uh, mount icon here also in this case you see on the left this is here this my book hard drive so I would click on mount and uh, it would take a couple of seconds or a minute and eventually uh, the uh, operating system would tell me that there is uh, an error it would always be here this disk management disk center error zero and there was no way I could uh, get rid of this so this would always be persistently there and I couldn't find a way how to fix this on my Mac so I googled it and even there was no information on how to consistently uh, get rid of this problem. So the way that I found to fix this real easily is to uh, go to a Windows machine so this is your Windows 10 and I plug this into the USB port and then the uh, Windows will tell me that there is a problem with the USB drive and I have to, or it wants me to scan it and repair it. So I'm going to let uh, Windows do that. And you see this going on right now. So uh, for me, I have here this 8 terabyte hard drive and this probably took about 20 minutes to go through this entire drive. So this will, will take a little while depending on your hard drive size. But eventually it is going to successfully repair the hard drive and then at this point all you have to do is just um, eject the uh, or unmount the hard drive from your Windows machine and then I'm just going to switch over to my Mac here and as soon as it finds the external hard drive now everything works back as normal so it's mounting it okay and can, I can instantly start using it again yeah so this was already it here this is how I fix my external hard drive on the Mac. Unfortunately only with the help of a Windows machine, but uh, if you found this video helpful, then give me a thumbs up and don't forget to check out my other videos.